Hey guys, welcome back to Frenemies. I'm Ian. I'm Chris Alain Bohige. And we are back with another episode of Demon Slayer. Last episode, Tanjiro made past the uh, seven day thing, got his sword, got his crow, and the uh, noodle hair got his sparrow. So, interested to see if that thing talks or not. <laughs> I'm going to start brainstorming names for that crow <laughs> right now. Ours or Tanjiro's? Tanjiro's, yeah. You know, it's all upside down. No, it's not. Oh. <laughs> Just can't leave that now. Whatever. <laughs> Whatever. <laughs> all um, right. Nez goes awake after two years of sleeping, yeah. uh, which we forgot to mention last time. <laughs> we sure did. <laughs> so she's gaining power. Or, or strength, at least, strength back strength by sleeping instead sleeping of eating back. humans. How much strength uh, do you think she has now that she's asleep sleep for two years? Probably like one punch and then goes back to sleep. <laughs> she just falls asleep mid-fight. <laughs> yeah, mid-fight is like, I'm done. Right. <laughs> um, like instead of knocking out, she uh, knock out punch, she knocks out as well. Yeah. <laughs> That's like, I she just launches herself <laughs> at him. <laughs> um, Crap, what's it? We had the Bakugo. Uh, well, I have to see the crow. I just visualized the crow. That's right. We have the Bakugo character showing up. Um... Honestly, I know there's a lot more than Bakugo, but I mean, that's the one that comes to mind at the forefront right now. Um, yeah, that girl didn't say anything. She did not say anything. Um, she's a college one. And she's, I think, the she only one that didn't seem as battered. She was unfazed. I think. She was playing with butterflies. She was playing with butterflies. Maybe that's, she did, did she get a crow? Huh? Did she yeah. get a crow? Okay. It'd be funny if she got butterflies instead. Or what if the crow <laughs> came and ate the butterflies? <laughs> <laughs> Her appearance just... Like she comes, she shows up all dusty afterwards. Like that's it was like an, a cam, uh, what's it, a, an illusion? Illusion, yeah. Her butterflies are magic. Yeah. Um, she is. That'd be that'd be helpful against demons. Probably. Um, which by the way, they use something called which we also Blood didn't talk about. Arts. Blood demon art, which we also didn't go into last time. Sure episode. didn't. <laughs> <laughs> we suck. Um, just put this part. <laughs> in the... And then the the clown mask guy shows up with uh sword. Tanjiro's sword, yeah. He, which turned black in his hands, um, which I'm assuming is good considering it's supposed to absorb sunlight and helps mm -hmm. them taking out demons. And he's got his first job thanks to his talking crow friend, um, saying that there are you know deep girls missing in this town and that there's he's he, they didn't I don't know if they've seen the demon but I mean there's a, uh, there's a, a suspected demon in this town taking girls. I don't know why it'd be specific girls, but I guess we'll find out. Can you keep my pen? Like it's been so many months. <laughs> Did you stop and. Like <laughs> uh, I honestly didn't expect that. <laughs> I gotta say. Yeah. Let's take it, I take it you didn't the first time as well? No. You didn't? Not at all. <laughs> How did you feel when that happened? <laughs> well, Anger. at least next week. <laughs> that's a good way to end an episode i feel yeah nice <laughs> all right so i don't know i mean she was only protective of uh tanjiro which is understandable because she sees him and she knows this is his brother her brother i don't know if using that hypnotic suggestion on her is necessarily going to be good in the long run because if she breaks through that i don't know how she's going to react to it that's my concern. Yeah. Shrink. Nezuko,のけりで助かったよ。ありがとう。うん。どこから蹴っても壊れないなんて。狭くないか苦しくないか。Oh, <laughs> So he's been grinding his teeth since he was a human, a young human. That was not... But now he's a demon, so he's got super speed grinding teeth. Yeah. That's probably the most obnoxious way to use super speed ever. Yeah. <laughs> I don't like it. I, I mean, it's so. kind of creepy. Yeah, it super is. And then when you realize... It's still kind of creepy when you realize what it is, but it's, it adds an, a, a layer of annoying. Mm -hmm. <laughs> it's just like, he's grinding his teeth. He's literally doing that to piss people off, I yeah, think. Yeah. Well, it's probably also just a habit of his, and just like, nah. maybe <laughs> I don't. But you know, yeah, still, I don't know. I mean, it, it's working for us a lot because now she's pissed off that he's attacking these two people. Yeah. So, and I, that really sucks. <laughs> it's like my siblings, yeah. who are dead. 
Yeah. I want to avenge the. Yep. So. Pretty much. But won't that kind of like drain her every time? I don't know. Uh... I don't know how much <laughs> sleep she needs. Yeah, I mean, she freaking slept for two years. So it's I'm like one of the. I'm hoping that was a one time thing. It's like she one might of... just need a little. A couple days, a week. <laughs> It'd be funny. It was like one of those one-time uses, uh, secret weapons. Yeah. It's like, I, I, can't, I can only use this Once in, desperate, every two years. In, in desperate times. This was an accident, though. Yep. So luckily I used that up. <laughs> yeah, exactly. So, Glad my first mission I had to use <laughs> my secret sister. To be fair, this demon can split itself into, diff- into multiple three. versions of it. I don't know if it's just three, but right now, yeah, three. Yeah. So... That means the next episode, I'm assuming, is just going to be solely based on just... And they all seem to have different personalities. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. They're kind of re- uh, resembling them twice. Or, yeah, they are. Or, or just, just, there's three of them. Yeah. So, um, the one is like, just mm, calm down, oh, other self. Calm down. <laughs> <laughs> um, so, okay, so it was going after 16-year-old girls because they're flavor, apparently, which is interesting. <laughs> Respect, right? Uh, you shouldn't say that. <laughs> um, but anyway, uh, no. Apparently, so it was, I guess like I don't know why if it's it's just sixteen year old girls. Like if it's why it can't be like younger males as well. If that changes the flavor, I guess it does. But just like nah, I'm a picky eater. Even though I need humans to survive, I'm gonna also. He, I mean, he's taking taste and consideration of these. So I guess so. I don't. I don't know what that's about. Well, you but can't fault him for it. I can. I really can. I'm not <laughs> saying he's not a bad. <laughs> I'm just saying. At least a demon can taste. I guess. Sure. <laughs> um. So there's a lot of pins in that uh, jacket of his, though. I there say. are. I really am glad we got to see that. Yep. <laughs> so I mean, it was to it was assumed that that one girl. Uh, uh, so that one. The ribbon girl. Satoko. Yeah. Satoko. She's dead. We kind of figured that. Yeah. Considering it's been more than a day, maybe. I don't know how long it has been since she disappeared. Yeah. I, I think they said, but I don't remember. But I don't know. Was that somebody who was interested in her, his sister, or what was that? I didn't really... I don't know. Because, I mean, he could just be going back to her dad and was like, she's vanished. That's what I'm Sir, assuming. I'm sorry, but I don't know. Because either they were, like, together or... They were siblings. They were siblings. I don't know. I don't know. Um, yeah. Either way, he seemed to care about her a lot, obviously. Yeah. He was heartbroken after finding out. She's dead, by the way. Yeah, because he was so, like, oh, you want to see this ribbon? Yeah, it's like, oh, is it in one of these? I mean, I can't is, remember. She's probably dead now. I ate her, probably. Yeah. Um, so that's great. Um, really cool thing, real quick, about that uniform is it's not just cool looking. It can apparently withstand being tar- torn by fangs and uh, claws. By low so. level. Well, yeah. yeah, but also it, it's not as susceptible to catching fire. Yeah. So that's really helpful. Yes. I mean, if you were to, you know, be it fully en- true. But if you were to be fully encompassed by fire, it would it, that wouldn't catch fire. But I mean, he'd still probably his face. Well, that's not. They important. need to make masks for them. That'd be cool. It would be. Uh, you know, be Gloves. able to withstand fire. Yeah. Just Shoes. completely encompass them in that material. Would be Just nice. a ball. <laughs> Um, with a sword just sticking out. Yeah. Uh, it's like that one picture with Kirby with but, a knife. But other than that, I was I'm I'm curious about what like what the different like what exactly the hue lends to their properties because they said or was it Rudaki that said that the hue depending on the hue it it has a different property and they said that the black that's less known about it and they they don't go far. So I don't know exactly why that's the case. Like, is it weaker? Or that's why they said those known about it. Yeah, I know. Because they said that red out fire and mm-hmm. blue Which... is water, but he's using water. Yeah, that's interesting about that. I don't know. I'm assuming blue is water. I don't know if they said it. I'm just assuming that. Mm-hmm. So I guess maybe uh, Noodlehead's going to be yellow. Yeah. Oh, yeah, yellow. It's the lightning. Cool. Um, did he say the red's fire? Yeah. Okay. That's why that one guy was freaking out because he wanted to see a yeah. bright red sword. And he was hoping that would be him because of his red hair, red eyes, yeah. and his family. He's like, "You're a lucky one." Yeah. Um, but once I, I, I know he says something about like the box, which is it's a really cool box, by the way. Um, but it's I know it's what is it made out of cloud mist pine, which is yep. just sounds cool. Um, but he says something like other pro- like it's strong, light, lightweight, um, not easy to break. Um, <laughs> rock liqueur or lacquer or something lacquer, yeah. to reinforce its exterior, which. Is, uh, more durable. Okay, 
So it just and also it just looks cool. Yeah, it does. <laughs> and that's a nice looking box, and it's definitely it's a little bit smaller, I think, than the yeah. basket is wearing. So she's got to really shrink, yep. which is I'm wondering what was I going on there. I think that's probably why she was like, eh. yeah, I don't know. It just seems like she wasn't sure about that. Yeah, <laughs> I was like eh. I was wondering like maybe wood was like kind of a thing or something. I was like. So that would suck. He made this. Really, he's made this box and he can't use it. Yeah. Um. But he he wants to make her a bigger one. I don't. I want to see why. Like they didn't show her going in. I mean they showed her going in, but they didn't show her. Yeah. Like they just show her just like go and just kind of seep in there. Yeah. I'm like she. I want to see what it looks like with her in there. Yeah. Um. But it apparently only one demon can turn people to demons. And he was the first one yeah. to become a demon. Yeah. But I want to know how he became a demon in the first place. If he's the first one to be turned, and only one demon can do that. What if he just came from hell? I mean, he said he became a demon. I don't know. Maybe he did some kind of ritual that you shouldn't do, and he wanted to become a demon himself, or he drank a demon's blood or something. I don't know. I don't know. He did something. If he was the first demon, he... how would he drink a demon's blood? No, he was the first human to be a demon. Oh, maybe. <laughs> So that'd be interesting if he was like a demon slayer or something, and then hmm. became a demon. I don't, I don't know. It'd be interesting. I don't but know his name is that. Muzan Kibutsuji. And yet, also the title of the next episode. Yes, it is. Which I, I am we concerned really with. Didn't want to know, but I mean, it's fine. <laughs> it's interesting. I, I don't know why it's gonna. <sighs> yeah, I don't know why it's gonna be there because we're not done with this fight. We're not. Which me. <laughs> yeah, he just shows up. It's like, hey, hey, I'm watching you. It's your sister. I killed her, but she's alive. I made her mean. Yes, yeah. so, it's relatively early to like reveal the the guy. Yeah, guy. Uh, yeah, and so. give a, a more information as to how she is, what she is. Yeah, I'm happy about that. Yeah, but I'm but also, I'm concerned as yeah. to. What's, and he's been was it a thousand years? Yes. So he's got to be pretty strong. Because that last dude was. Fifty. Well, he he's eaten fifty kids. But he was also there for like oh he's there for I don't know, fifteen years. I don't remember. But he's not no a thousand. That's yeah, for sure. Yeah. So this dude's been eating a lot, and he's not big looking though. Yeah, he's I know. Still, as we we've dubbed him Michael Jackson, but now we know his actual name is Muzan. And Kib- so he's still Kibutsuji. Michael Jackson. Well, I like Kibutsuji though. That's a cool name. Yeah, it is. Um, why the demons have a cool name? Um, demons. Yeah, I guess. Uh. So I, was, I don't know how we're going to get into it, or maybe he's going to interrogate him about this guy. Maybe he'll know him. Maybe, because he said that he had to ask him more questions. Yeah, he said so. two more questions or something like that. So, uh, yeah, I was I was um, wondering as to whenever he first got to the town why he was saying that, or what it meant when he said uneven demon sin, which is interesting. But I guess, I don't know if it's because of the fact that he split up, or it was just because of the fact that he can do that thing he I don't does. Know, maybe. So that was really weird. I wasn't sure about that, but it, 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 it kind of shine a light on what he's what this demon can do in the first place mm-hmm. um but i thought it was funny was that when he shows up he just starts sniffing everything around him yeah and everybody else they don't know what the heck's going on he's like he's just like what is this kid doing <laughs> they, they really blur the line of like funny moments yeah and awful horrific moments yeah. <laughs> there's not a whole lot of in between yeah there really is a whole lot of in between um, there's more like somber moments that aren't horrific, like yeah. like the whenever uh, when Tanjiro was leaving, um, Uraki, it was kind of like uh, when he was watching him leave. Yeah, it was like, kind of like dad, a dad saying bye and everything, yeah. which is terrible because like every all these kids he kind of sort of takes in, and he raised those those one those two kids before, and he kind of sort of sees them as his own it seems, and so we better see more of them. I really want I'm to. Really I mean, I don't know where else uh, Tanjiro can go. I mean, this is he just he he's left to go on this. First job, so I'm assuming he's gonna come back. Maybe. I mean, I don't. We in the in the uh, intro, don't we see him um, training with the kids at Urokodakis or? I don't know. No. It was just a house. It did seem bigger. It did also have a fence. I don't know. I, I don't know. Then I have no idea. Okay, so after this though, we're finally into new territory for you. So yeah. You have no idea. I mean, you haven't had a whole lot. I'm worried. Because you've forgotten a decent amount. Because I'm a moron. <laughs> but now you're just completely in the... That's the best thing about me, though, that I'm an idiot. Because I can react to stuff <laughs> that I've already seen and be like, I've never seen this show once. <laughs> well, guys, that's it for this episode of this week's episode of Demon Slayer. Uh, next will be Austin's, you know, he'll be completely fresh on it, so that'll be interesting. If you want to see that early, go ahead and check out our Patreon. <laughs> well, you get 24 <laughs> episode season. Heck yeah, one season. Um, God, I just remember that. Early access, comments down below as well. See you guys next week.